What's up YouTube? Welcome back to the channel guys. This video man, I was so freaking excited. I forgot to just unbox everything with you. Uh, but this video is actually sponsored by Classy. Whoa. Classy House. As you can see right here and right here. Uh, I'll probably put the air freshener thing on but I don't like stickers on my car. But yeah, this video is sponsored by them. And um, let's see. I'll go ahead and give you his number right here. His name is Ross Moorhead. Uh, hopefully he don't get mad at me, but it's free advertisement. Classy House Productions. Everything is right here. And I think he's located I think he's located here in Texas. Yes, he is. So, hopefully. Does it focus in? All right, there you go, it's focusing. Uh, and he is an authorized dealer for airlift and all that. So if you need some work, he also install, or you need this, what I'm about to show y'all, give him a call, email, hit him up on social media, it doesn't matter all right so with that being said you wondering what this is today so let me show you so this is my airlift management thing right here so it goes in just like this and this thing just lights up now I just gotta run my wires and actually see where I'm going to mount this at so that's going to be the the most interesting part and then you want to plug it in the back right here but other than that guys that's pretty much it man i'm just y'all don't know how long i wait for this uh i just couldn't find um i couldn't find a a kit for this because I just had my stuff hanging and I found him on Instagram and I was just I was so freaking happy so let's talk about what comes with this and um, we can get on to that information and price it and all that well I'm not gonna quote the price but you can go to his website uh, which is www.classyhouseproductions.com and he can quote you the price but yeah man, it's gonna look good I'm so excited um, so what comes with it guys of course it's the uh rgbw which is controlled through your phone or your phone uh case kit thank you majiggy bobby and here is i'm not even going to open it up here is the actual rgbw thing that it plugs into and you actually i mean actually i want to open it up because i can show y'all So this right here plugs into here, just like that, as you can see. It did. You plug it into this side right here. It's really self-explanatory, guys. Super self-explanatory. And then this is the power connection, which goes right here. And then you just connect this to negative and positive that's it it's that freaking simple guys that's simple but your challenge is going to be where you're going to find this to mount up at and then you have the screws right here in a double sided tape to actually have this settle down onto the uh onto the uh bracket and then here go the screws that go to the back of this and then double sided tape to go where you want to mount it that freaking simple Excellent modification, very uh, cheap, don't cost a lot of money, but let me go in my car and run everything and figure out where I want to mount this. Let's get it, man, I'm happy. All right, guys, so I got everything inside. So all I need to do now is run the actual wires. Um, well, not the actual wires, I have to run this wire. Cause I used to just have my thing sitting just right here. So what I'm thinking about doing guys, to be honest with y'all, 
is uh, I'm thinking about right here maybe what y'all think right here can y'all see that? No, y'all can't see that. Right here? Oh no. It'd be crazy to put it over here. Or smart. To put it over here. What y'all think? I think I'll put it right there. But let me run the wires. Yeah. All that good stuff. So I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Right back. Finally disassembled my car. Now this is why my wife always say I'm tearing up stuff. Prime example why. So the reason why I took this thing out is because I'm not getting air suspension. So I need to and I need to utilize that space right there for this new upgrade that I have. Um, so. I'm going to run power all the way around and loop it into the LED lights underneath here. And this is just not long enough. This is what I had powered at first. But, yeah, yeah, I don't want to hear that. I'll continue on with the actual build. So... So this is the look I'm pretty much thinking about going for. So I'm running into the problem that I knew I was going to run into is actually positioning this freaking mount, man. I knew I was going to run into this problem. Um, so let me show you my thoughts of what I wanted to do. So this is one of my thoughts is it's like this uh keep it nice and clean nothing crazy just right there so it can be accessible to me and then the, the shift then the other thing i wanted to do is come way over here but then i'm thinking i don't want to reach way over there then i was thinking here so this is the problem I'm actually running to. I think this is the honestly the best look for it. I don't know. I have no idea. I don't know. Well, comment below. Tell me which one y'all think is the best one. Um, but I'm about to wrap this up because it's getting really late. As y'all can see, it's dark. And you hear all types of crickets and stuff going on but I think this is where I think this is where it's at I don't know I don't know guys
so I'm about to make sure the power is working and everything as you can see we have the classy house productions uh, air uh, uh, e-level uh, bracket right here uh, it's floating look fingers go straight through it's floating right now perfect perfect position um, I just got to make sure it's secure which shouldn't be no issue so I'm about to connect the power to make sure I didn't do all this stuff for nothing <laughs> wouldn't that be something and guys when I say this thing is so easy to install it's easy to install and just a reminder when you hooking up this thing right here uh, see I have it plugged in wrong white needs to be where it, oh, let me show you so you see the white cable in there blue so that's what that means white well it's the opposite way It's RGBW red green blue white you have to make sure the white is with white guys very very important uh, I don't want to know what happens if you don't have it correct and I'm not going to find out but here is the moment of truth quick wire see how everything works and look guys that is awesome y'all see it and then you can see the lights right here as well So let me actually cut off my ring light. Dog, that is freaking sick. Sick, 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 sick. Alright, so what I'm about to do guys, I'm about to clean everything up and show you the end result. Yes, guys, I am very freaking happy right now. Very. Alright guys, so last but not least, the last thing you have to do to get this thing to work. Oh, it's a true air fresher. Dang, this thing smells. You're going to send me some more of these. This thing smells good. Let's see if it goes over my big old. Ah. Yep. Last but not least, now I am officially classy house boy. And this thing smells good. It smells great. So the moment of truth, guys. Are y'all ready? Actually, you know what? Let me cut the light off over here. And then I'm also going to cut the light off in my garage. So, y'all. Oops, going to mess up my camera. Dang it. See, I told you I was going to mess it up. And you know what's so crazy about this ring light, man? Watch this mug still work. I dropped this thing like a thousand times. Told you. <laughs> I dropped that thing a thousand times and it still freaking works. I only paid like 20 bucks for it on eBay. But yeah, let me cut the garage light off. So y'all can see how it looks. There you go. You know what, I wanna, I wanna cut these other lights off too. Good job again. A real 
real good look of how it looks. Connect back to it. Alright. There it goes, guys. That is clean. Yep. Yep, there it goes. That crap looks good. Focus, focus. Yep, I am happy with it. Um, cut the lights off so you can see somewhat of me. Can't see nothing. So. Alright, so what I have to do now is pretty much nothing. I just got to set it up on my phone. And that is pretty much it, guys. It's so simple to set it up. Uh, you just read, uh, do the QR code, and then it will be on your phone. <laughs> yeah, but overall, man, it looks freaking good in here. You can't see it because my tenant windows make everything look dark. But I'm in love with it. So look, check it out. It looks really, really good overall. I think that's a perfect spot for it and everything. And I took out the actual gauge that I will no longer use, which is right here because I am not getting super charged. But yeah. All right, guys. So my battery. My battery actually went dead. That's all I have pretty much for the video, man. Please make sure you go check out Classy House Production, guys. And I want to give him a huge shout out for sponsoring this video. Um, I think if you don't have this type of bracket for your airlift or AccuAir, you ain't doing the right thing when it comes to air suspension. Just look at it, guys. Just, like, just overall, look at it. Look how it's just sitting there, floating, and everything. Super nice. But other than that, guys, that's all I have. This is Robert YouTube on the budget, guys. Peace.